regrets. I've had a few. The voice may not be what it once was, the popularity remains. At this San Diego concert last year, the audience knew it was hearing a musical legend. He has style and phrasing, and you can hear what he says. And Sinatra is still very big in record stores. Of course, it's not records now, it's CDs. And if you were to buy all of the titles here, you would walk out with 41 different Sinatra CDs. And Sinatra music sells well, always has. Mainly the older generation of people buy, you know, who grew up with him. That, that's more the people who appreciate his music. You don't find a lot of 16-year-olds coming in here seeing what Blue Eyes has on the shelf? Not really, no. Fill my heart with song. Let me sing forevermore. He has been through, as one of his songs puts it, many cycles in his life. Now he may be the venerable elder statesman of popular music, but once he was the Elvis or Beatles of his day. Young women in bobby socks thought Frankie was the end. And while other musical figures come and go, Sinatra endures. So do his fans. Well, I always did like Sinatra. Did I get a kick out of you? He certainly has done some of the best music that's been done. And while he has made a career out of singing standards, he has attempted to update his material from time to time. Yeah, he's bad, bad, Brown. This is not to say that he has been able to capture the musical imagination of every generation. Can you give me your opinion on Sinatra? Don't know. But time and Sinatra march on. The CD of music from the TV miniseries is selling well, and there will always be an audience for the man they call the chairman of the board, old blue eyes, or simply the voice. That's why the lady is a tramp. There have been bumps in the road musically, voice problems, career slumps. He even retired, but he always came back. And do 